morning students dear students today we will learn how to solve the sums of division students we have 48 rupees and we have to divide these rupees equally between these two children but you can see here we have two notes of rupees 20 that means one one note can be given to each child but we have only one note of rupees 5, one note of rupees 2 and only one note of rupees 1. So, in place of one note of rupees 5, I have taken two notes of rupees 2 and one note of rupees 1. But to divide rupees equally between two children, in place of two notes of rupees 1, we will take one note of rupees 2. Now, we can easily divide rupees equally between two children. So, dear students, after dividing rupees equally between two children, you can see each child got, yes, 20 plus 2 plus 2 is equal to 24, means 24 rupees. Students, now we will solve it in the writing form. We were having 48 rupees and we had divided these rupees between the two children. So, to divide the rupees equally, firstly we gave one one note of rupees 20 to both the children. That means 2 multiplied by 20 is equal to 40. And after that, we were left with 8 rupees. And from these 8 rupees, we gave one one note of rupees 2. To both the children, that means 2 multiplied by 2 is equal to 4. And after dividing rupees equally, we were left with 4 rupees. And from these 4 rupees, we gave 1 1 note of rupees 2 to both the children. That means 2 multiplied by 2 is equal to 4. And after dividing rupees equally, there was no money left and no means 0. So, from here we get after dividing rupees equally each child got 20 plus 2 plus 2 is equal to 24 rupees. Now in the division form we were having 48 rupees and we had to divide these 48 rupees between the two children. So first of all we gave one one note of rupees 20 to both the children. That means 2 multiplied by 20 is equal to 40. And after dividing rupees equally between the two children, we were left with 8 rupees. And from these 8 rupees, we gave 1 1 note of rupees 2 to both the children. That means 2 multiplied by 2 is equal to 4. And after dividing rupees equally between the two children, we were left with 4 rupees. And from these 4 rupees, we gave 1 1 note of rupees 2 to both the children. That means 2 multiplied by 2 is equal to 4. So, in this way, after dividing rupees equally, there was no money left. And no money means yes, 0. So, from here we get... After dividing rupees equally between the two children, each child got 20 plus 2 plus 2 is equal to 24 rupees. And from here we get when 48 is divided by 2, the result is 24. Where 48 is dividend, 2 is divisor and 24 is quotient. In the homework, dear students, solve the sums. Given at page number 115 of your maths book. Thank you.